Welcome, and thanks for stopping by. Today I'll be making German potato salad. Let's get started. I have four medium-sized potatoes that I've scrubbed and cleaned really well. And I'm going to take each of them. I have a, a toothpick. Do you see the toothpick? Okay, yeah. So we're just going to poke holes in all of them. Quite a few because you want them to absorb these flavors that we're about to add into this water. And this is number four. Make sure you put enough holes in it. Mm-hmm. And I have the water just enough to cover. Just enough to cover the uh, potatoes. And so here I have a half an onion. We're just going to chop these up in big chunks. Big chunks. That's good enough. I'm gonna add them into the water. And I have um, five cloves of garlic. And I've already peeled those. So I'm just gonna smash them. I'm gonna add those into the water. Mm hmm. I'm gonna get some flavor up in these potatoes. And I have some bacon. Bacon. And I'm just going to cut. Let me show you. See, I like the end because it has a little more fatty meat on there. And I'm just going to cut so much off. That's good. We're going to add these into the water also. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Mmm. I think I might add a few more. Another slice. It's up to you, though, how much bacon you want. Turn my pan on. I'm going to turn it up to a high just to get it going, and then I'm going to bring it down like I do most of the time. And here I have some sugar. I have about a fourth of a cup of sugar. I'm just, we're gonna add that in too. Yeah, yeah. Just hold on. This is flavor. And I have about a cup. Of, of apple cider vinegar and in this goes also some salt a little more and pepper and so now we're going to cover Like I said, bring it up when it starts to boil. Bring it down to a medium. And then let it cook until they're tender. Do you know how to check? And you stick your fork or your knife in, and when it goes in easily, then your potatoes are ready. Okay, these potatoes are done. Mm hmm. <coughs> So what I'm going to do now, you see this pan that I have back here? I have a, about a teaspoon of um, bacon grease in here, but you can use olive oil, vegetable oil, whatever type of oil that you have. <clears throat> and I'm going to kind of fish this bacon and these onions and stuff out of here. And I'm going to put them in that pan back there. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, I'm gonna leave these potatoes in in here while I cook up uh, the veggies and the bacon that was in the in there with the potatoes. Excuse me. I'm gonna turn that on. Let me get this cooked up for our sauce. cook this until this bacon crisps up. It'll probably take a minute because it's been cooking in the uh, the water. But just keep cooking. That's about how you want that. And I'm going to uh, put it over here on this paper towel. We're going to finish up the sauce. Some helmets. Just a couple of heaping um, spoons full for now. Okay, so we're going to add in some salt, pepper. Apple cider vinegar, vinegar, about a teaspoon. That's all we need. Some sugar, sugar, sugar. Do about a teaspoon of that also. Get that stirred up. going to taste it. Mm -hmm. Let me see. I think I'm going to add a little more vinegar. Apple cider vinegar. And I'm going to add a pinch more sugar. green onions, the whites and the green. Add that in. And the bacon and onions and garlic and gonna add some of that in. some cold water over these and, and, and drain them. No. I'm going to peel these and then make it hot in your hand. They're still pretty hot. Do the best that you can do. a lot of potato, but 
lose it. In other words, you have to. I have my bowl ready. Scratch over here. And we're going to cut them in squares. And yes, this is really hard. You cut them as small as you can or into this bowl. I'll do the same thing for the rest of these. Ooh. This is our last one. See it smoking. <laughs> Just cooking my little hand. Okay, and again, we'll slice it. Slice it. And slice it. Small. Squares. Before we add our um, I'm calling it salt, and I reserve some of the water. I'm sorry, I didn't tell you some of the water that we boiled our potatoes in because it's really flavorful. And in case our um, our mix is too thick, we can add a little of that flavor of water to break it down a little bit. Just in case. A little bit, just a little bit. Okay, and here is our delicious. And I kid you not, it's delicious. Gonna add some in. I made just enough. Toss. Mm -hmm. And the longer you set it in the fridge and let it cool, the more it marinates. But it's good warm too, because I like warm potato salad. Any kind of potato salad. Mm. Put some of this in a bowl. Good. 
this potato salad is really good. It's worth the effort of doing it all. Please believe me. Mm-hmm. And it's going to sprinkle, sprinkle some greenery on it. Let you see it better. It's good. Mm -hmm. Well, I had another little piece here that I read. Kind of inspiring. And it says, No matter how hopeless or happy a situation might seem, never stop praying. Prayer is for every moment of our lives. Not just for times of suffering, but also for joy. Prayer is where you meet God in a genuine conversation. So thank Him for all the problems that turned into blessings. Mm-hmm. Don't forget to pray, y'all. And remember to subscribe. Tap that bell. Give me a thumbs up. Share with your friends and family and comment. I would love to hear from you. Hey, try this. You might like it. Well, that's it and that's all. Until next time, eat well and be well. Boop. Love ya. Later.